situated right there in the middle of the Soyuz vehicle. Contains those customized seats we talked about earlier for the crew members during the launch, entry, and landing phases, and also has all of the controls and displays necessary for the flight. 41 cubic feet, so it's definitely a bit of a tight fit. And about 110 pounds of payload can come back, and it's the only portion that survives re-entry. The orbital module, which is accessed through a top, uh, a hatch at the top of the descent module, uh, is connected via that pressurized hatch. It's where the crew has a small amount of room to move around during the flight to the station, and has a slightly larger volume of 230 cubic feet. And at the very top has the docking mechanism hatch and rendezvous antennas located. Or they're deployed, two solar arrays are folded against the body of the vehicle, uh, against the body of the propulsion module, which sets off, and when that shuts down and detaches, the Soyuz will be in its preliminary orbit. And so again, getting good reports, everything looking ready for launch at this point. The first and second stage engines ready for launch. Telemetry has been received from the rocket, indicating that all, that all of the primary and backup systems are indeed ready. Under five and a half minutes away. The exact launch time is targeted at 4.17 and 2 seconds p.m. Central Time. The launch command issued. These engines now ramping up. Engine turbo pumps at flight speed. Engines at max. And lift off. Mark Vandehei, Alexander Mazurkin, and Joe Acaba lifting off and now on their way to the International Space Station. Ten seconds. A little over 10 seconds already into the flight, getting good first stage performance. So he's delivering about 930,000 pounds of thrust from those four boosters and the core engine. Forty seconds and the vehicle is stable. Continuing to get good calls, the vehicle stable, everything looks power actually being jettisoned. And just got confirmation the escape tower has been jettisoned. The four minute forty three second mark, then the Soyuz will be ready to do what's called a hot stage technique, and that's when the third stage will ignite while the second is still burning. That's why if you remember views of that rocket, there's that lattice structure, that open area between the second and third stages. And we've just crossed four minutes since launch. And there, the telltale jolt, that tells us that the third stage has cut off, getting confirmation it has separated and coheeds.
Decreasing still. May I ask you to connect your so-called spacesuit. Could you secure it here? Do you want me to do it here in DSA? No, please stay here. Joe will do that. Okay. Stand by one. the hatch open 1208 a.m. central time 12 or well 108 a.m. eastern time while the station flew just 255 statute miles over Serbia First one through the door, Alexander Mazurkin, the Soyuz commander for all of the events today. This again, his second trip into space, second stay on board the International Space Station. Just behind him, NASA astronaut Joe Acaba making his third flight into space and his second time as a long duration crew member on board the station. Bringing up the rear of the first timer, Mark Van de Hei on his first space flight, making his way into the International Space Station for the very first time. All right, and with that, the crew of Expedition 53 back at a full six person. And now the crew's gonna make their way over to the Russian service module. And once they're all set up, we'll get these voice calls started and they'll be able to speak to the folks back over in Baikonur. Three, welcome aboard ceremony. Baikonur, this is Mission Control Houston. Please call station for a voice check. This is Rob Navius with your colleagues, families, and friends in Baikonur. How do you hear me? Rob, we've got you loud and clear. Rob, we've got you loud and clear. You all look great up there, and uh, we'll start the event. Papulka, Daddy, hello. Hi, my dear. How are you? Hey there. We're not cold, we're good. Is it warm over there? Well, you see we're all cozy here. (laughs) 
Родной, привет, родной мой. Hi, my dear one, I love you. You look wonderful, even excellent. Keep it up. Keep it up. Thank you. I love you.